in 2013 when Japan was awarded the right to stage the 2020 Summer Olympics Tokyo officials said they could stage the games for 829 billion yen or in US dollars 7.3 billion US dollars it was a comparatively thrifty plan at least compared with other olympics an expert panel set up by tokyo's newly elected governor has predicted that the price tag of the 2020 olympics could exceed 30 billion us dollars that figure is nearly four times the original 2013 estimate the lack of a capped budget and government administrations laying blame on one another is a slap in the face of japanese taxpayers who are footing 80% of the bill to add insult to injury in order to curb spiraling social security spending and desperately improve child care facilities a goods and service tax gst hike is due in october 2019 This has also resulted in a worrying sum to the International Olympic Committee which has struggled to find willing bidders to host the games in recent years because they have become such a financial burden. The IOC's attempts to tamp down host spending on the Olympics came about for two reasons. Both of them very embarrassing. For one, cities have become increasingly reluctant to bid on the games, with Oslo dropping out of the running for the 2022 Winter Games after being selected as a finalist by the IOC, leaving it to choose between Beijing and Almaty, Kazakhstan, two less than ideal hosts. For another, buildings constructed for the games have increasingly become expensive white elephants. The local government in Pyeongchang, South Korea, site of this year's Winter Games, has complained about spending millions in upkeep for Olympic buildings that no one is using and athletic buildings in Rio, site of the 2016 Summer Olympics, have been left to rot in the wake of Brazil's economic troubles. What steps IOC has taken to prevent similar situations? In response, the IOC unveiled the new norm which aims to help Olympic host cities get a better return on investment by in part paring back the costs involved with bidding on the games and requiring host cities to have a concrete plan to utilize their olympic infrastructure of the games end already 49 measures have been applied to the 2020 tokyo summer olympics enabling 2.2 billion dollars worth of savings but the full benefits will be reaped by the beijing 2022 winter olympics and paris summer 2024 olympics was hosting olympics right choice for tokyo time will tell The financial burdens are not going to shrink overnight. However, PM Abe San is keen to take measures so that they don't fall out in the journey of Tokyo 2020 Olympics. Keep watching our other videos on Tokyo Olympics. Till then, take care and goodbye.